So uh, just recently we made a new discovery in our exotic garden and uh, we've uh, come across a rare white, I'm going to call it the Albino Fatsia Japonica. So uh, this is my seed grown, one of my seed grown Fatsia Japonicas, Japanese Aurelia, huge beautiful leaves. These are growing in dappled light, although it's getting some sun now. Uh, this is a variegated one growing beside it. Our biggest variegated ones are probably about maybe 13 feet tall. But coming off the base of this variegated one is a pure white, pure white Fatsia Japonica. I've never seen anything like it. Here it is. Let's pull it over here. It is absolutely beautiful. And somebody said to me, well, how could you have just discovered it in your garden? Well, we don't have a normal garden here. We're not on a city lot. This garden stretches hundreds of feet with thousands of plants in it, okay? So it's easy to miss this if we don't come to this area very much. And this is one area of the garden we don't really come to all that often. It was kind of hiding underneath this. So there it is, a pure white Fatsia japonica. And uh, no, I'm not going to propagate from this. It probably wouldn't survive. But uh, it's, a rare, it's an oddity. I like it. It's different. Beautiful foliage on it. And it's totally healthy. It's got nice glossy leaves. So there's the variegated one beside it. Let me pull these leaves up. There it is. What do you think, folks? Leave your comments below. This is growing in our garden on the Gulf Islands in the North Pacific. All right? I call that the albino Fatsia japonica. A very tropical-looking BLE. We have so many of these in our garden. We probably have more than two dozen uh, Fatsias in our garden, and the big, uh, some of the bigger ones actually self-seed. Thanks for watching, folks, and stay tuned for more videos from Banana J S S I.